Thanks for joining us, Faf. First of all, congratulations on your debut. I guess, is it how you imagined it would be? Uh, I imagined this probably uh, every night dreaming for the last 10 years. To, first of all, to make my debut against Australia was, it was for me a big thing. You know, you always want to make a debut against a quality team and test yourself against the best. Um, but for it to go the, the, the way it went, you know, it's more than a dream, actually, than it doesn't feel real. And how do you manage to maintain your concentration for such a long period of time under the conditions? Yeah, I just, we just try to break, break it down you know, into hour sessions because if you look at it from yesterday, it looks a long way away. Um, but if you, like I said, we break it down into hour sessions and it's a drinks break, then you go lunch, drinks break, tea, drinks break, end of the day. Uh, but luckily there were guys with me, experienced guys. You know, for my first time, I had a lot of questions for them and they really helped me through it. So after two draws now, what's the feeling in the dressing rooms going into Perth? Are you sort of confident of being able to take the last win? or I think uh, the, the Aussies now know that we won't roll over um, and, and just be beaten easily. You know, we're going to fight. They played very good cricket, um, but we didn't, we didn't let it go. We kept fighting. Um, so for us now, we'll take this away as, as a great thing moving forward um, into the next game that we won't give up. Um, and you never know, you know, if we can next game... Might bowl very well and bat very well, and then we won the test series. And then this first two tests, Australia would say they, they should have won. They should have won those test matches. I guess that's the next thing: is uh, how do you manage to back up both uh, physically and mentally for Perth? It will be something I learn as, as I go. You know, it's obviously back-to-back -back test for me is new. Um, so mentally and, and physically, I will um, pass out in the changing room now. Um, and then relax today and tomorrow and just take it easy and then mentally just slowly start getting back up for, for the next test match.